Tonight, an Indiana mom is suing a public school district, alleging her special needs son was repeatedly abused and neglected in the classroom. Call 6 investigator Kara Kinney has been digging through that lawsuit, which is now in federal court, and she joins us with details. Kara. That's right, Todd. The attorney who filed this lawsuit says in his 24 years of practicing law, he's never seen a pattern of abuse this long. Melissa Christensen's son, Cody, has autism, anxiety disorder, and other special needs. She alleges in her lawsuit that the Kankakee Valley School Corporation staff excessively isolated and restrained her son. These 2013 pictures show what the family believes are rug burns from being dragged across the floor. Christensen says the teachers and staff repeatedly used excessive force, physical restraint, and seclusion with her son rather than using appropriate interventions such as redirection and positive reinforcement. She tried meeting with the school, filing complaints, but her attorney says nothing worked. He's essentially, um, instead of occasional neglect or mistreatment, being subjected to a pattern of almost sadistic and cruel mistreatment at the hands of his teacher and, and school staff. The Kankakee Valley School Corporation declined to comment on this lawsuit. As for Cody, his mother pulled him out of school and he's now attending a different school in Lafayette. I'm Call 6 investigator Kara Kenny.